here. I'm going to stand here and I'm going to do what I want to do. I've been letting you guys do what you want to do for the longest. Drag my father's name through the mud. Drag him through the mud. But he was killed on the streets. And this cop is still higher. He's still on the police force. Why? Because if Eric Garner would have fought back, he would have been in a fucking jail cell. He would have been in a jail cell. Out to the jail. Out to the jail. of Eric Garner's death is tomorrow, and we do understand the Garner family is expected to meet with the Eastern District of New York. The big question out here this morning is, what's going to happen? Black Lives Matter! Black Lives Matter! Black Lives Matter activists raising the alarm. Tomorrow, the statute of limitations will expire, meaning federal prosecutors will no longer be able to file federal civil rights charges against Officer Daniel Pantaleo. The protesters went to Washington, D.C. yesterday to rally outside the Department of Justice there. It was July 17, 2014, when Eric Garner was selling loose cigarettes on a Staten Island street. Officer Pantaleo arrested him and put him in a chokehold. As Garner lay dying on the street, he uttered those famous last words, I can't breathe. Officer Pantaleo has denied wrongdoing. And the NYPD officer was cleared of criminal conduct by a state grand jury several years ago. We also still do not have a ruling from last month's Civilian Complaint Review Board disciplinary case at One Police Plaza. The police commissioner will need to decide if Officer Pantaleo is fired for Garner's death. And we are expected to hear from both the Justice Department and the Garner family late this morning or early this afternoon. Also, the New York City public advocate has announced he'll be speaking out with Eric Garner's mother. 